And as the WIAA state tournaments wrap up this week, a big summer is just getting started for a local nonprofit here in Madison, Try for Schools. We are joined this morning by the executive director, Katie Hensel, as well as Patrick Johnson from Middleton Sports and Fitness. Thanks for being here this morning with us, guys. I'm going to start with you, Katie. Tell us a little bit about the summer ahead and uh, more of the background of this program, Try for Schools. So Try for Schools uh, gets kids excited about being healthy and active throughout their lifetime through swimming, biking, and running. Um, this summer we've got a few big things coming up. We're going to be running our after school program at Harbor Athletic Club called Exercise to Achievement, which helps kids train to complete our Middleton Triathlon that's presented by Middleton Sports and Fitness coming up in August. Yeah, you mentioned it. One of the big things uh, about Try for Schools is the partnerships with the local community. And Patrick Johnson is here from Middleton Sports and Fitness. Uh, Patrick, tell us a little bit about why this partnership is ideal for you guys. Well, you look for a way to give back to the community. And uh, Katie's been fantastic. Uh, just when we first met her, it was a perfect fit. And like she was saying, it's all about the kids. Um, you know, getting them into our store is great, but uh, getting them out and getting uh, a lot of exercise is always a, a fantastic thing. And getting them out and getting exercise. Uh, talk to us specifically, Katie, what does that look like? What programs are going on and what can we expect this summer? So uh, through our, our after school program, what we're doing is uh, offering kids lessons in swimming, biking, running, as well as nutrition and conditioning and, um, and then the life skills that accompany being active. So teamwork, confidence, sportsmanship, that sorts of thing. Um, that'll be taking place June through August. And then our triathlon is on August 22nd, which is open to kids ages three to 14. And we usually sell this race out at about 500 kids. And one program that everyone around the Madison community is excited about, a new one, uh, Exercise to Achievement program. Tell us a little bit about this new initiative from Try for Schools. So we started this because we realized that while it's great to have these big one day events, um, the real you know, mission for us is getting kids active throughout their lifetime and keeping them active. So we wanted a way to get uh, more of a consistent impact in the lives of kids. So uh, we use uh, community partners like Harbor Athletic Club and Middleton Sports and Fitness to work with us to offer opportunities for kids to train consistently for these races. So you've got kids that are putting in a lot of miles um, trying to achieve that goal of completing a triathlon. Patrick, you know something about this, a collegiate athlete yourself, uh, now at Middleton Sports and Fitness. Tell us about um, that kind of age range of growing up and just being out uh, outdoors and, and being an athlete. Uh, how did that play into your life and why is it so important? Well, nowadays, you know, you have technology and all that and it's sad to see kids indoors and this is one way to get them out and get them uh, running around and get exercise. Um, and like we said before, Katie's just a great partner with us and it's been a blast for us. Katie, where can people uh, find out more information about Try for Schools? Uh, the best way would probably be to check out our website. It's tryforschools.org. Um, and you can find all of a, a link to all of our events there, including our, our Middleton Triathlon, as well as we have a fall mud run coming up um, and a Halloween fun run in October. Well, Katie and Patrick, thanks for joining us today. Thank, Thank you. you. We'll be right back.